Hello Game Gum Shoes fans, Chris here with another Game Gum Shoes Presents. This time I want to introduce you to Angry Birds Jenga Death Star Game. Yeah, I know it's a lot of words, long name. It's actually kind of fun. Um, I know everybody knows, or at least probably everybody knows, uh, Angry Birds, especially with them getting ready to come out with a Angry Birds movie. Uh, with Angry Birds, you've got little birds you shoot and you're trying to destroy pigs. Well, since this is a Star Wars themed game, of course, all the characters are based on, you know, Star Wars characters. So you've got the pig version of Darth Vader, a pig version of the Stormtrooper, and you know, there are other characters involved, but in this game you're just dealing with Star uh, Darth Vader and the Stormtroopers. Um, you also have a little X-Wing pilot, which is probably supposed to be Luke, um, as an angry bird. Uh, you have a Hanzo looking ish bird. That's uh, the yellow one. It shoots a little weird. And of course, there's the Chewbacca looking one because, you know, what game wouldn't be complete without a Chewbacca character? Um, in it, you have this lovely little launcher that looks like an X Wing. You place your little characters um, on the X Wing. You pull it back and you launch it, very tiddlywink style, at the structure that looks vaguely like the Death Star. Throw these down here real quick. And so the Death Star structure starts out as this frame. Now there's a little cardboard insert that goes in here and it's got a bunch of numbers as you can see and it's got places for where the pigs are supposed to go. Um, inside each of the tiles, um, back in the back corner, there's a number that tells you where it goes in that form. This is a number two. And this odd looking little piece here is a number six, I think. Possibly a number nine. Not 100% sure on that one. Um, I'm going to go with nine because I don't... Oh, number six is underlined, so it should be easy to figure out. But you basically, you know, fill in all your pieces. You know, once all your pieces are filled in, including this locking pin that fits up here in the top of the structure. You know, yes, it does stay, believe it or not. Once you get all the pieces in, you're good. Um, it goes into this base, you pull the cardboard out, and then you start firing away your birds. Now, the way you can tell which birds you're going to shoot is based on this dice. Um, the die has a little picture of whatever bird it is and how many shots you get at the structure. Um, of course, Chewbacca comes in one and two, the Han Solo character comes in two and three, and the little X-Wing pilot, probably Luke, comes in a two and three as well. So um, it's kind of interesting when you're shooting these things across the room, especially if you're in a crowded restaurant and um, watching everything tumble. The nice thing is the, 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 the parts that fall out aren't necessarily your goal. You want to shoot for the Darth Vader, the pig, uh, the stormtroopers. You want to destroy the entire structure because that's where your points lie when you're playing the game. Um, it's a very fun game. Uh, at first I was very hesitant, but a buddy of mine picked this up for me and said, Hey Chris, check this out. I picked it up at the store. The only problem is there are no stickers. Now, there are stickers on this dice, as you can see, and I would like to thank Hasbro for sending me out a sticker sheet so I could apply the stickers and play the game properly. Uh, if you ever have any questions about whether or not you're, you, know, you, you pick up a game and, and you, you like, this is missing, or you know, the rules aren't there, or whatever, and you're worried about you know, the cost and stuff like that, don't. Hasbro is very reasonable. Um, I can't exactly say how much they, they gave me my stickers for, but uh, definitely very reasonable. And, you know, don't be afraid to pick up a game somewhere and try to find out, um, even if you pick it up from a Goodwill. You know, check with Hasbro or one of the companies, whoever makes it, to see if you can get the parts that you need to complete your game. Uh, if you have any questions on whether or not your game is complete, feel free to contact me as well because then I can let you know if I have a copy of the game or if I can verify it myself. But anyhow, thank you for joining us for the Star Wars Angry Birds Jenga Death Star game. And uh, I'll see you on the next review.
Thank you.